Hey everybody, it's Miss Carrie. So as you can see, today we'll be making our own frog hats. So I had lots of fun making that. So what we're gonna do next is we're going to make our craft. So what you will need is your um, frog, crayons, glue, and scissors. So our first step is to color our frog. So what I'm gonna use is I'm gonna color the frog green, but you can color your frog whatever color you would like. There's all kinds of colorful frogs. I've seen purple frogs, orange frogs, all kinds. I've mostly seen the colorful ones at zoos, so. So I like frogs. They are super cool. And what's special about them is they can live in water and on land because they're amphibians. So that means that it's an animal that can stay in water and they can stay on land. So that is something that I think is super cool. Now, do fro are frogs when they're born, are they completely frogs? Are they, do they look like what you usually think of as frogs? No, they start out as what? Tadpoles, that's right. And then they start going through stages where they grow their legs and they turn into the frog that we all know and love. One of my favorite char like, um, characters is um, one of the Muppets named Kermit. Kermit is the frog too. And he talks kind of like this. It's Miss Carrie's Kermit voice. Like Kermit. Almost done coloring. At least with the green part. Then we'll call around his spots and his eyes. Okay. Oh dear. Okay. So we got the green. So next what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna color his little chest area. So Give his chest area a little bit of orange. Let's make him a colorful frog. And for his cheeks, I'm going to use purple. Have you ever seen a frog with purple cheeks? I haven't either. But this frog has purple cheeks. Next, we'll color his spots orange. Okay. And then we'll give his eyes a little bit of color. We'll give him green eyes like his skin. Let's do that. So there's our frog. And then I have this little thing that we're going to glue around to give it the hat shape that we need so it'll fit on our head. So I'm going to color that one green to match the rest of his skin. And There's our little thing to give it its hat shape. So our last step is to what? We're gonna glue this to the frog. So I'm gonna put a little bit of frog 
a little bit of fog. Did you hear, Miss Carrie? A little bit of glue on the frog right here. That wouldn't make sense. Frog on your frog. Miss Carrie, Sue. Put that right there. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. It's done. See? We've got our hair shape. Let Miss Carrie scoot down so you can see. So there's our frog. So I hope you enjoyed this craft today. Miss Carrie has copies at the library. If you drop by, be sure to pick one up at the children's desk. And I'll also post the link to the template that I used online. So if you drew the craft, as always, share pictures online with us on our Facebook page. So I'll see you next time, guys. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.